Welcome, this is the energy vibration reading for the Cancer Sun Moon and Rising. It is the 12th week of the year 2018, and the week begins from the 19th until the 25th. I want to say to you guys that the energy vibration that is the hurt energies and the zodiac is water for Monday and Tuesday is going to be good for you as of Friday it becomes the fire energy so be aware so let's see um, thank you so much for your likes likes and shares and thumbs up please remember uh, to listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign and also the energies for the second quarters is out the video is upload so for April if you want to know what's gonna happen April May and June for you guys you can check that out the the new uh, focus the focus for April May and June is the forecast for April May and June is all uploaded so let's see what you can says up for Monday yourself the energy vibration of the people between the ages of 18 and 45 on Tuesday you have the energy of the lovers in the reverse oopsie daisy on Wednesdays we have the energy of the um, the six of Pentacles and this person was someone from a soul connection and on Thursday you are spiritually protected you have nothing to worry about on Friday you have the energy of the devil <laughs> On Saturday you have um, the King of Wands <laughs> on Sunday you have the energy of um, balance okay um, balance temperance and you have the two of Wands whatever the energy is you have the energy of the two of ones okay whatever the energy is of the two of one there is a new beginning and a new start um, and this um, for a lot of people it is with work um, a new beginning and a new start with work okay you're having a new beginning new start with work okay so um, for um, um, some of you you're going to realize um, there's going to be a realization that for um, you and men on Tuesday that you have lost the love of your life you have lost a soulmate um, that um, you know whatever has happened you have lost this person um, this is going to um, be somewhat painful for you but um, it's because of your ego why you have lost this person so let's see um, who is this person not to worry um, news um, um, news is going to be coming to you okay the knight of pentacles whoever um, so some of you could be with the Knight of Pentacles and um, you have lost this person what is that then in the middle of the week energy of the star comes out you have victoriously overcome a situation with the Knight of Wands okay um, you have victoriously overcome a situation with a Knight of Wands the Knight of Swords is here so you have a victory over the Knight of Swords and the King of Wands. As we go further, um, um, the Knight of Wands comes in again. So a lot of you have a situation, and you have this um, six and two. Six and two is eight of cups. You're leaving a situation behind that has to do with this. Um, um, this this person who is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, you're leaving the situation behind. Okay, 
so let's look forward with the energy of the ten of swords um, the devil um, and the night the night of ones the night of ones um, this is someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius so he is here twice in your reading and he has something to do with um, some money and the rest of it but you're leaving the situation behind and then he's here that's fire sign man again and it has to do with an Aries here so you have an Aries here and you have an a Leo and a Sagittarius because it's, um, it can be a Leo and a Sagittarius the last energies that you have to close off is a heartbreak okay a heartbreak okay I need to see what is this heartbreak over because heartbreak seems to be coming up a lot of heartbreak seems to be coming up so what is this heartbreak over with this um, block not to worry the energy of the Sun comes out okay so here we are here we go so there was a situation that you had to do deal with that has to do with someone who is an an Aries it's an Aries man or woman and there was a heartbreak because the ten of swords there was a lot of lies and stuff and you had an heartbreak and there that's what blocked you from your soulmate um, that is what blocked you from your soulmate because I'm seeing a block with your soulmate and information is coming out okay information is going to come to you um, cancer so a block there is you know obstacles blocks between you and and, and and you feel lonely and heartache okay um, you feel really alone and heartache and this block um, as a car because of this Aries person so this it, it can be um, you could be in a relationship with an Aries and it could be a man or a woman and trust me um, this is not a nice person because you're you're gonna overcome the situation okay because there's a lot of energies that are here you're gonna overcome the situation but um, see you feel um, lonely cold it's as if this this person is having a, is, is a, a coldness um, a cold heartedness that is coming at you and um, from this person and it's as if you're in this relationship with this person it's as if you are married to this person but there is no love it is just cold there is just there is no love coming from this person now um, and um, you had a secret lover a hidden affair a crush on someone and you have lost that person so um, now I'm understanding you 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 because Monday and Tuesday you realize that you have really lost someone who is a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn for good you have you have you have realized this that you really lost this person for good um, and whatever it is you had to deal with these two person um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn or um, an Aquarius a, li a Libra an Aquarius um, Aquarius of a Libra of a Gemini and whatever that has transpired you're going to get news about this person because um, this person the person who blocked you 
from having this relationship is someone who is an Aries Leo or this is an, an Aries because the energy of the devil is here with this person so it is an Aries who um, block you from this relationship who um, end this relationship with you and your the love of your life this is someone who you have a serious serious um, connection with um, and th this was the love of your life is someone who you have some of you have a secret crush on um, and that is the love of your life secret love uh, some of you had an eaten a fear and some of you had a crush with this person but you have lost this person you know and this person was either in Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn there was so many um, people because you have to deal with an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and what you're realizing now is that some of you are married to an Aries and this is coming up and some of you are married to this Aries and you're realizing that you know this is not where I want to be um, I I miss the love of my life I miss the crush I miss my secret affair because that was the love of my life there is nothing here there's just coldness this person is not giving you the warmth that the the other person the, 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 the person that you have were having this hidden affair with um, was giving you they you know make you feel loved but this person is not really making you feel loved because you're in a loveless relationship and you have lost this person you have really lost this person and this person was a soul a soul connection a soulmate that come out from a lifetime a lifetime before as we look at the ending of the week you have to deal with this person who is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and this is someone over the, the age of 40 and you're leaving him behind you have you you know you're having so much regrets and you're leaving him behind and you're moving forward in your life sorry I am just thinking about and the truth it is the truth um, you know it's kind of hard for you to swallow the fact that you have end up in a loveless relationship and the love of your life you have lost the love of your life because of your ego because of you um, you know because of the ego you have really really lost the love of your life and you know there is a person that is uh, and um, because I'm, I'm, I'm getting a Leo um, there's a situation that has to do with money and um, this Leo and you're you're walking away you're turning your back on him you're having some balance and stuff and you're turning your back on him um, it's as if this person had pushed you away from your soulmate and now you know how you felt about this person it's as if 
you eat sleep breathe this person but it's as if there's either a brother or a friend that has um, you know to told you to end this relationship and your heart is broken because you realize that you have lost her it could be a Taurus it could be a Virgo but it is an earth sign person and you really really miss this person and it's as if sorry sorry and it's as if you realize that I've made the biggest mistake in my life you have listened to either a brother or as as you know you have listened to your brother or you've listened to a friend who is a Leo or a Sagittarius and you left this person behind and now um, you end it with this person or you lose this person but not to worry money is going to be good for you there is going to be new opportunities not the same but new opportunities in business is going to come in namaste until next time